Moving on. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Uh, we are still discussing Anjana and Anjani and your questions which have uh, come to us. So moving on to the next question. Are you guys ready? All no. right. What if I say no? I don't say the next question. But what so if I say no? Because the next question is for Anbir. Okay, so no. I'm not ready. Ask him. No, no, don't do that, Priyanka. The next question is for you. Please be ready. Are we ready? Are we ready? Okay, let's go. We're enjoying it. So we can carry on with the next question. This one's, like I said, for Anbir. And a well-researched question. Hey, Ranbir, I know you studied acting at the Lee Strasberg Theatre and Film Institute in New York. So... Hey, I thought it was natural all this time. <laughs> no respect to me. From your experience with living in New York, what would you say was your best New York moment? Wow, uh, great question. <clears throat> uh, hi. Uh, who is this? This one's coming out from... Uh, New York. Well, actually, I don't have the name. Okay, New York girl or boy, hi. Uh, uh, New York itself was, I think, the biggest acting institute. Uh, Lee Strasberg, yes, I went to Lee Strasberg for eight months. Uh, I don't think uh, I have any moment from Lee Strasberg that I remember or which is memorable, but I just feel living in New York. I come from a very protected family. I come from a family where, uh, you know, I had all the luxuries at home. So when I went to New York, it's the first time I tasted freedom. It's the first time I, uh, I felt responsible for myself. I felt res responsible towards money. I understood the value for money. And doing all that, living in New York City was just amazing because I think that's where I really found myself as, as a person also. So New York has lots of memories for me. I, of course, went back to New York for Anjana Anjani uh, after eight years of uh, not being there. Uh, but it's really unfair to pick one moment. I think just walking the streets of New York at four in the afternoon or four in the night, the feeling was insane. Wow. That's awesome. You, you, you've stayed everywhere. You've gone around everywhere. Any place where you're actually yourself, uh, all by yourself, studying or maybe working away from family? Well, I was never all by myself because I come from a very protective family as well. Um, um, so I was never allowed to be by you myself. You were not a hostel girl, you were a day boarder. Um, yeah, I stayed with my family, my masses and all. I, I studied in America for four years, I did high school there. So, but I had to stay with my aunts, like I wasn't allowed to stay by myself. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I've never like a alone moment and my family is always with me. All right, so there you are. Question poochne wale ka naam nahi tha mere paas. So there you have it. But the next one is from Priyanka and this one's from Bhavesh. Dear Priyanka, if you... <coughs> All right, please. Oh God. This one's from Bhavesh and not from me. One arm distance. Dear Priyanka, if you were to choose anyone amongst them to marry, who would it be? A. Salman B. Ranbir Kapoor C. John Abraham or D. A common man Whom would you choose? Why? <laughs> and please Yes! Yay! <laughs> no, come on. But I just... Uh, D. Common man, Anjana So would you choose the Anjana, obvious? Anjana, <laughs> common man Look, Ranbir has married Really? That's breaking news, my friends So, uh, <clears throat> we are sorted it's all done. That's all done. Um, so now I have to think after Rabbi. Don't get upset, okay, husband? Hmm. <laughs> after him, if I had to marry anybody, then um, yeah, and Anjana, of course. Anjana, yeah? yeah. Ooh, uh, why? Why? I mean, do you, just to, just so, so that you'd get to know him. Uh, yeah, exactly. Uh, and I haven't married them yet, so obviously. <laughs> so it could be any Anjana. Could be you, but hey. They have already given the answer, so you can cut it. All right, Priyanka, that was wonderful. Next, here it is, an intellectual question. What is this actually? The question is from Imagine Complexly. That is the... Imagine Complexly is... The name, the ID from where this question has actually come. Imagine Complexly asks, What question has no one ever asked you that you wish you could answer? That everybody asks. Nobody asks in an interview, no? How are you doing? Like, how are you? That you want to answer. That you would like to answer. No, they say in oh, an okay. interview also. That's not right. Hmm. Question related to you, which people don't know about, and you say, yeah, sab kuch pooch tain, reporters bas ye nahi pooch tain. Well, if, uh, if you don't know, then you don't need to know, because then I didn't want to tell you. But nobody asked you that question. That's the no, reason but why. Like, Oh, no, it's, no, no, it's, it's, it's like a dream in a dream in a dream. Yeah, it's one of those. Yeah, it's one of those questions. <laughs> uh, what is it that somebody's... You wish someone should ask you. But no, I, I don't. If, if they haven't asked you, it's good enough. Yeah. <laughs> I'm anyway, like, a little private. So, the less the question... We'd like to see an eye-to-eye -eye sort of an interview sometime when Priyanka would be interviewing Priyanka herself. Maybe that's the time we'll get to know about this. So, imagine complexly. 
Unfortunately, there is no question like that. Yeah, I don't think so. All right, moving on. The next question is by Karina Sood, and she asks Ranbir and Priyanka both, what is the most annoying thing about each other? So when you're over with it, just give me a call. I'll be back. <laughs> All right, fine. This is... How do you know? <laughs> <laughs> it will go on How forever. How do you know that? No, you can tell me. I'm trying to get out of here. I'm trying to get out of here. But hey, tell me one thing. The annoying thing about Priyanka is... Um, you just go, go yeah, ahead and I'm say it. Like yeah. yeah, it's okay. I it's think the annoying thing about Priyanka is um, she's sometimes an emotional fool. Uh, she gets very affected by things where uh, uh, she really doesn't need to get affected by it. You know, she's, she's stupid and she stresses about stupid things sometimes. I think that's a bit annoying. I think about Ranbir, what is annoying is that he has this quality which I actually admire. I want to be like that because of this annoying facet of my personality mm -hmm. is he's a bit detached like he can just kind of switch off and nothing affects him and he has this barrier he has this wall that he builds around him and nothing can penetrate that he's there's no attachments of sorts which I mean is really cool I guess have in a way have you built that from or is it naturally uh, no I don't think detachment is our Lego pieces uh, I think uh, I don't think I'm detached I, I don't feel detached but That's because you're in it, no? Yeah, exactly. So I don't I, feel over emotional like a. Jacket. Yeah, I just feel that uh, I like being with myself. I like being isolated. I am. I am uh, not dependent on anyone. But uh, days go by, and I realize that people are so important in life that you cannot afford to be detached. I can be detached to things, but sometimes people do matter, and uh, you matter, Priyanka. Now, so do you, Mantra. Respect to you, sir. Thank you. Moving on to the next question. This one's. From Nikita from New Delhi, how was Anjana and Jani as an experience? Did both of you had fun on the sets and enjoyed working with each other? If given Did an you opportunity, play a prank on someone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, original. I think oh this. God. I think that's the reason why it's the last question of the Nikita from New Delhi. Nikita from New Delhi, hi from uh, PC and RK. Sorry, I said her name again. It's okay. Yeah, uh, Anjana and Jani was a blast. Uh, you know, uh, Priyanka, Siddharth. Ravi K. Chandran, Ahmed Khan, Sharmista Roy, the costume designers, the assistants, my staff, her staff. We all just became like a party crew. Party crew not with bad intentions of drinking and getting drunk, but a party crew of who's out there to make a movie and have fun. Uh, so I think it was a blast and uh, uh, Priyanka also had a blast, I can speak for her. And she had a really good time and she has such great memories about me that, uh, uh, you know, I was so good. I was just so good. <laughs> <laughs> but he's, you know, my illusions of anybody, it'll be shattered now because when we just set the standard so high. But I'm sure you had a good time. No, we had a great time. I mean, America was fantastic and I think everybody was really like-minded and we all really got along, like the whole crew. So we used to just hang at night, we used to all like hang out in Siddharth's room and... There was no agenda. Um, there was, yeah. Zero agenda. We just really you missed like, you got along. Ah! Yes, my Santras and Narangis. Don't get me wrong over here. Last question from Crazy Whamsy. Crazy from what? Crazy Whamsy. Crazy Whamsy. Yeah, would it be pronounced Whamsy? V A M S I. Crazy Whamsy. From London. This one's for you, Ranbir. Can I expect any kind of similarities between your characters in Anjana Anjani and Bachanae Hasino because both the films were directed by Siddharth Anand? No, I mean, I would be really saturated as an actor if I uh, did two characters in such a short span of time uh, which are similar to each other. I would just like to believe that it is a different character. Like I said, he is um, he's a bit of a low life. He is somebody who is very weak, uh, somebody who has no hope to life uh, and that somebody instills that hope in him. So in, to answer your question, no, it's nothing like Bashna you know, it's, uh, it's the same director, it's the same actor, uh, but that's it. That's the only similarity. That's it. So all my YouTube users and everybody else on the internet, that's uh, Kiara and Akash, Urf, Priyanka and Ranbir for you. YouTube users, would you like to actually say something to them? How, how much do you use YouTube? Ben? Once a day at least. Yeah, I, I don't use it once a day, but I use it at least thrice a week, for sure. All right, so internet users. Thrice a week, YouTube yeah, users. what? What do you see on YouTube? Just generally a lot of things. Like Mostly I go ahead and see the comments on, our, on the promo. Do you see all that? <laughs> So you know that you you better write some good stuff because Priyanka is actually going out there and reading them. Wishing you the best for the film, sir. Thank Ma you. First and of October. First yes, of October. first of October. Doing Thank well. You, no changes. Post this. First Stamp. of October. It is. It is. Stamp. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Cheers. Thank you. Bye.
to watch more, log on to www.erosentertainment.com.